Welcome to Herald of Glory Devotional. Today, Wednesday, September 8, 2021. Theme, You are holy and blameless. Hebrews chapter 3, verse 1, King James Version. Wherefore, holy brethren, partakers of the heavenly calling, consider the apostle and high priest of our profession, Christ Jesus. The opening remarks of our theme scripture is truly remarkable that we should look at it again. The Holy Spirit through the Apostle Paul makes reference to the saints and calls them holy brethren. You are not holy or righteous because of your deeds, but because you have God's nature of righteousness and holiness. He gave you his righteousness as a gift. Romans chapter 5 verse 17. Before God, you are justified. There is no record of sin against you. That's the reason he says you are without blame. People may have a different opinion about you, but that doesn't change the reality of who you are in Christ. Some even have said that no one is holy on this earth, but it is irrelevant. What God says about you is the truth and what actually matters. As a child of God, you must walk in agreement with God and his word. Ephesians chapter 1 verse 4 says, Even as in his love he chose us, actually picked us out for himself as his own in Christ before the foundation of the world, that we should be holy, consecrated and set apart for him, and blameless in his sight, even above reproach before him in love. In Christ Jesus, who is our eternal high priest, you are eternally justified and without blame. He was delivered to death for your offense and raised back to life for justification. Until you intimately acknowledge that God has made you holy, you will never live a holy life. Don't succumb to thoughts of unworthiness that will likely compromise your fellowship and faith. Because you have the life and nature of God, you are holy and can live holy. Hallelujah. Confession. Please confess. I am faultless, perfect, holy, unblameable, and irreprovable. I am righteous and holy. I am without blame. Thank you, Father, for calling me into your holiness. I live a holy life with no conscience of sin. Amen. Reflection. You are not holy or righteous because of your deeds, but because you have God's nature of righteousness and holiness. Further reading. Ephesians chapter 5 verse 27. That he might present her to himself a glorious church, not having spot or wrinkle or any such thing, but that she should be holy and without blemish. Matthew chapter 5 verse 48. Be therefore perfect, even as your Father which is in heaven is perfect. Read the Bible in one year. Proverbs chapter 21 to chapter 24. The Perfection Mandate. The Lord Jesus is coming for a glorious church, matured, perfect, and holy. Perfection is the goal of the church, and this is the ending focus of her out of glory devotional. Join the impact train. We are uniquely focused on heralding the Lord's glorious church. Join us in spreading the message of the Lord's glory and perfection to everyone in our world. Kindly contact plus 233-555-500-100. Plus 233-555-500-100. Plus 233-244-528637. Plus 233-244-528637. Herald of Glory Impact at gmail.com. Follow, like, and share Herald of Glory daily on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Pastor Julius Greyfield Christ Lord, Herald in the Glorious Church. Herald of Glory Devotional, your perfection manual. Enjoy a perfect day. You are blessed.